Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass here, and welcome to Undertale. Undertale is a unique RPG adventure game with shoot 'em up gameplay, where you also have the option to interact or spare your random foes. It remembers your choices in playstyle or even multiple playthroughs, and through this, it does a lot of fourth wall breaking stuff. Name the fallen human. I suppose I could just go with Manly, but that'd be kind of odd. Oh, what the hell. Now, I've played the demo, so I'm unsure if the initial area is just the demo, essentially. But I'm going to play through it anyway, for the sake to see if there's anything new on Thurs. For consistency, in a playthrough, really. This is also going to be an attempt at a pacifist playthrough. I think the kill them all playthrough is actually a little more interesting as far as the fourth wall breaking stuff, but... Pacifist first, because I like just abusing myself. Howdy! I'm Flowey! Flowey the flower! Hmm... You're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me, your annoying sidekick, will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. So basically... Unlike most RPGs, a lot of the battles take place in little mini shoot 'em up segments. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of levels. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Eh, coming from a stranger, that's a little bit weird. Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Down here. Love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. Hey, buddy. You miss him. Let's try again, okay? Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the... Bullets! I've been friendly ass bullets. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Oh. I've played Toho, I know how to dodge this. Go for the... Go for the shrinking hitbox. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, uh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Torio, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. So yeah, so far the same. Also, her name's upon a tutorial. You didn't get that. Weapon stick, armor bandage. I wonder if I'm only allowed one save point. Let me check real quick. I don't remember. Yeah. So I can't just save scum and cheat. Well, I can save scum, but I can't have multiple saves to go back on old decisions and like progress further. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the runes. The runes are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the side of them.
only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the mill road. To make progress here, you'll need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Let's see the read signs. If you're reading this, you probably already figured that out. Stay on the path. Please press the switch too. No. Are you are you trying to imply something? I wonder if I have to keep going after whatever they'll change the dialogue up. Splendid. I'm proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. I don't think I hit the other switch. It's not a real switch. What? As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight, also known as a random encounter. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Unless you're a sick monster, you want to murder them all. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Hi, how's it going? You come around here often? It's a dummy. It doesn't do anything. You talk to the dummy. Doesn't see much of a conversation. I won! I wonder if there's a bonus for not even, like, attacking anything, period. There are some enemies I think you do have to, like, bruise up a bit, though. Before you can spare them. It's really... It depends how dynamic this game is past the demo area. If it, is, if it keeps that consistency, then I'm really wondering how many variations you can have in a playthrough. It actually almost makes me nervous. I kind of want to see everything. Not oh, random, a random battle. I think this is the first case where I can actually kill it, but... Hey. Life is difficult for this enemy. So like, don't even try it, buddy. Don't even do it. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. This is the puzzle, but... Here. Take my hand for a moment. Toriel is kind of a funny meta commentary on the state of gaming nowadays. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Once we just go back over them. Oh, you can't even kill yourself even if you want to. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh my god. By myself? That's... that's an adult responsibility. I don't know if I can make it. Dramatic music. Cause how scared I am. The fear. Yep. You're behind this, aren't you? Greetings, my child. Do not worry. 
I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. It was merely a ruse. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just follow me, why don't you? Just call. Be good, alright? So, say hello. Pretty much. Hi. About yourself. Best code bomb. Call her mom. Oh, flirt and call her mom. Extra kinky. Sure. Go bomb. Let's flirt. No, I'm serious. Damn, that's anime as hell. I do it multiple times in your response risk changes. <laughs> it remembered. It remembered. Interesting. Child. Yeah. Salutations. Use your imagination. A monarch. I'll be the king. Take these dialogues out of the way because I know what's coming up soon. That's it. That's all of them. Ring. Man, you already called me already. We just talked. Hello? This is Torio. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Froggy. Ribbit. Some. This monster is too sensitive to fight. It doesn't even try to hit me. Hey. I won! Piece of candy. Take two. Take triple. I'm a monster. Now no one gets any candy. Ah, dang it. Huh. 
Hello? This is Torio. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. You're breaking me a cake, aren't you? Are you calling again? You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right? Right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. This is one of them. This is the... Puzzle. Damn. Oh, yeah. This is, uh... You have to remember where the leaves are, then go around. Don't step in the leaves. I think it was this one. And then... And this one. And if I can... Go! Oh! Alright. Hold small. Basically, a trapped up in no brains. Let's flirt with it. What a meaningful conversation. Line of them. Quick flirt of all of them. Sexy wiggle slap sounds and squirch. Ooh man, that was Selva sparing. I can't remember if it was a way to gain XP by doing damage. <laughs> this is the one this is the one rock. There's four rocks, and three of them can be pushed. Mm -hmm. So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm. You want me to move some more? Alrighty. How's this? That was the wrong way. Hmm. That was the wrong direction. Okay. I think I got it. There you go. Don't you move back. Hmm. You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Don't do it. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fuels you with determination. One day, you'll get that cheese. Boo. This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force? No, I have to move it with force. Naps to Blook. Doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. They're real funny, yet they're crying profusely. Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Looks a little bit better. Let's cheer you up. Hey, what did the ghost say to the ghost? Absolutely nothing, because ghosts don't exist. That's that's not a sign of being funny.
Oh no, it's crying now. Wasn't the right option. Oh my god, that was a hit. You gonna show me a trick? The Dapper Bluke. Nice hat. Made of your own tears. Oh no? I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Napster Block went to the next world. Spider Bake Sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. I got a donut. Four spiders. Froggy. <laughs> oh no! F four, and it's like in a plane. Looks. Don't pick on him. Please, no bully. Oh, I got hit. I sneak a gold, but no XP. Monster wears the old name when you can spare it. Toriel. Hello? I just realized that it has been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday, you might see something you really like, and you will want to leave room in your pockets for that. I hope there's like not some punishing endgame thing. Like, oh, it took all the candy. There's just one switch. So one of these has a switch in it, and that's gonna be the right one to drop the spikes. It's vitamin A. And those carrots look like penises. Talk. That's can't talk, dummy. I think this is one that I had to bruise him a bit. Because of the whole bruised vegetable joke. Don't die, you'll ruin my run. Seems kind of bruised. HR Greens. Oh, he actually healed me. Yeah. That one. Mm. 
There's something in that one, though. It's another puzzle. The far door is not exit. It simply marks rotation in perspective. Check on Mold Small. Mold Small, I can just outright spare. It's not attacking me. He's just swinging his arms. Well, that was easy. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. We have to the blue first. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Behind this. A clicking sound. It was in the right. Oranges in the hair. If you can read this, press the red switch. I wonder if there's a trick here where the red is actually the blue, and then the blue would be the red, based on their original places. This is way too many. <laughs> My heart just walked off the screen. If you can read this, press the green switch. Green's always in the bottom. Nope. There we go. I think I've reached the end. Cross. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. Knife. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. I'm, I'm right here. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? I wonder if I could have actually waited. There, there. I will heal you. I should have not left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I could not hide it any longer. Come, small one. Every time this old tree grows in the leaves, they fall right off. Seeing such a cute, tiny house in the ruins gives you determination. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. So it's both. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on the snail pie for tonight. That actually sounds kind of good. Here, I have another surprise for you. But first, explore your house. It was the year 20-0-X. The war was beginning. The tools are found to make him safer. Turn out the monsters were the good guys all along. Same book. Yeah. Oh god, now syndrome. Everything is like safe in this house. The fire you can't burn yourself, the tools you can't cut yourself. You. Brand name chocolate bar we can't name or we get sued. 
What a nice smell. Do want to eat though. What's downstairs? Oh. Hey, do not go down here. I have something to show you upstairs. And this is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. I didn't give you permission to pat my hand. Is something burning? Uh, make yourself at home. Cool toys, but I'm not interested in that. Oh, I didn't want to take a nap yet. Pie. Butterscotch cinnamon pie. I wonder if I could have, like, gone down there and made her burn the pie. Read the circled passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. And... Jokes of a similar high caliber. Flow with the flower. Plant flowering plants with brown and blonde seed pods. Water sausages. Scandalous. Toriel sock drawer. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most sundry of plants. It wants to be hugged, but it always pricks you. Room under renovations. It's my me. It is a water sausage. Yo, next gen. Mirrors. I think I missed an Easter egg by going to sleep too early, but whatever. But mom, I won't play down here in the creepy place. It's not drafty. Mom! It's not dusty. There's something totally to see here. No. I want to go down to the thing. Stop getting angry, Ma. I can do what I want. I'm ten years old already. Yes, really. Something, something the matter? Okay. You win. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. You know, while I gotta take over as your parenting. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This... 
this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It is called 17 Uses for Snails. How about it? How do I exit the ruins? Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a radula? Interesting. Oh, I exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. I heard her feelings. Oh man. Pie. I should probably have that safe point back there. I'm totally gonna exit the ruins this time. Oh, you're already here. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. I'll be a good child and go upstairs. No, that's not how this works. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they... Asgore will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. This is the... In the demo, this was the fight that really changed depending on your playstyle. And, uh, whether or not you've done it before. You want to leave so badly. Huh. You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you're strong enough to survive. Knows best for you. Oh, God, I've got the patterns on this. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Gotta remember my toe. Oh, got a nail on the side. You can't actually kill her. There's actually a lot of ways to do this fight. That's really cool. Left, right. Ooh, 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 ooh. You don't want to fight me. I'm not gonna fight you. I'm doing a pacifist run. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, I'm gonna die. She actually will go out of her way not to kill you, though, if you do hit that one health range. You can die, and she will react to that. But she'll purposely avoid her shots if it gets too uh, close to the death point. I think I've actually hit that point now. She's just avoiding him. But... So you don't even have to dodge. She doesn't want to kill you. You can force yourself to die. But... She'll never do it. But please, go upstairs now. I promise I'll take good care of you here. 
for an interesting turn of events, you can actually attack her in one shot her right here. It's actually the, the worst option. I know we do not have much, but... That's only if you want to go a true demon route. We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? For alternate takes on this fight in some of the early areas, I recommend just watching my demo playthrough. Please, go upstairs. Huh. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No. I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Goodbye, my child. Goodbye. This should be new territory. The demo and Floyd the Flower was here. I don't know if he's here anymore. I think he's was exclusive to the demo. If he's not in this section of the game, that's like I said, a really good reason to go and check that scene out. Oh, he's here. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spend the life of a single person. <laughs> well, I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Whether you kill out of frustration, or whether you give up entirely on this world, and let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan is in regicide. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> Fuck off, fourth wall flower. But yeah, if you actually replay the game, or at least you replay the demo, and you came back here, he will change his dialogue and react to it, and he'll remember your choices. So, if I do a full pacifist run and I come back to this area and end up killing her, he will comment about how I'm a horrible monster who got bored and wanted to see suffering. <laughs>